Meantime, let's check back in at our Operation Backpack. Chris and Kelly for us live on Challenge Way in Sacramento. Chris, how's it going? It has been a great day and obviously we started on our morning shows early this morning. We're just wrapping up pretty much here. We still have about 15 minutes. Would love to take a backpack off your hand. Take a look at the table. We've had to empty this table at least five or six times since I've been here at about two o'clock this afternoon. That's how many backpacks we've had. Final tally that we've had at this location here in Sacramento is at 2510. 2510 backpacks that are going to kids that will need it coming this school year. That's an exciting day indeed. And once again, thanks so much for your generosity. Thanks to the volunteers for America. They're celebrating 100 years of being in Sacramento. What better way to do that than collecting a bunch of backpacks for kids that are in need? But that's not the big grand total. For that, we go to West Sacramento. That's where David Beenick is standing by at the Target. David? Hi, Kelly and Chris. Yeah, Target has come for come through for Operation Backpack in a big way again this year. Take a look at this. A whole cart full of backpacks. But take a look at this. This is not the only cart. There's also that cart there, this cart here, cart number four, cart number five, and this entire table. Uh, Jamie Jones is the store leader. How many backpacks in all do we have here? We have 100 backpacks and 100 of every single supply that we've carried. So all the supplies included. Buying backpacks is like buying a birthday present. You never really know what the kid wants. How did exactly. you decide what to put in? Well, we did a great variety. So we have all the way from anything that a kindergarten would love all the way up to high school. All right, time is running out on Operation Backpack. So let's give the word and, and get this, this, this stuff loaded out into the, the truck that's waiting outside. Let's move it on outside. Back up the truck, everybody, and here we go. And let me bring in Jamie one more time as they're, as they're rolling these things out. Jamie, this is a prime time of you for be to selling this material. Why does Target want to donate this? What, what's in this for you? Well, to help the community. So our biggest thing is education for our kids. Target's very involved with the education of our kids in our community, and we like to volunteer and help the kids. So this is one thing that one way that we can give back to our community. And you say throughout the years, as part of the events you do, you see the need in the schools. Exactly. So not only do we like to donate things like school supplies, but we also do library makeovers um, to give back to our community. So we'll go into local schools and basically make over their libraries as well as playgrounds, any needs that they need from landscaping libraries to their playground. All right, well, on, on behalf of Operation Backpack, thank you very much again. We're going to bring the carts back in, load up these backpacks, and get them out to the Tri-Counties Bank right away. Live in West Sacramento, I'm David Bean at KCRA 3 Reports. What a great picture. And by the way, the kids pick out their own backpacks, so you see a big variety there. They'll get to choose the one that really strikes home for them. Let's give you a quick update now on our breaking... Basically make over their...